you don't have your clipper, and this is what your baba does. Before they bob your hair, you're in trouble. Let's watch this video. There's a particular disease called hepatitis B. And one of the ways that it is actually shared from person to person is by sharing sharp objects. And this clipper is a sharp object. Because you did not see the blood does not mean that it did not cut you. And hepatitis B virus is a very stubborn virus. And if you leave it on a particular surface, it can stay there for as long as seven days. Secondly, it is more infectious than HIV. Thirdly, it can lead to liver cancer. So that's and spraying that they are doing does not actually kill the virus like that as a professional barber let me clear this up fake clippers like these are designed to cut hair not skin the chance that they will injure you is very slim and even if they do clippers do not cut deep enough to carry significant blood contamination unless you are in the quack barber show now According to the World Health Organization and the Center for Disease Control, hepatitis B can be spread through very small amount of blood or body fluid, but it requires direct blood-to-blood -blood blood contact in the hands of a professional barber like me. Clippers do not puncture the skin that way. Also, professional barbers like me disinfect with clipper sides and sterilizers, so the actual risk of contracting hepatitis B is extremely low. But instead of boxers and singlet this year, my dear, a clipper will be nicer because you are also protecting yourself. A proco doctor is right. Having your own personal grooming tools can reduce the risk of cross-contamination. But here is what most people don't know. As a professional barber, I do not just use this. The tool designed for beard detailing and clean shape of is a trimmer. So if you are buying your own tools, don't just stop at a clipper. Buy a trimmer too. That way you will get the same precise finish you expect at the barber shop. See you in the next one. That bad guy. Buy your own clipper. Take responsibility for your health. Sure.